Sairam students, welcome back. Hope all of you are doing fine. In today's session, we are going to learn about writing skills. Yes, we are going to learn a new topic about writing skills and that is information transfer. That is information transfer. Children, in your, your uh, standards, earlier standards, you must have learned about the flow chart, the web diagram, the pie chart, tree diagram. Yes, or a tabular form. All those are forms of through which you get information. Yes. So, suppose if something is given in a tabular form and when you convert it into a paragraph form, that is called as an information transfer. Or if something is given in a paragraph, you, are, you may be asked to convert, transform it or transfer it into a non-verbal form or maybe a web diagram, a flow chart, a pie chart, a bar also, a bar graph also. So, all these things consist in information transfer. Okay. Now, what is information transfer? Information transfer is rewriting of information from one form into another form. Yes. So, from one form into another form. And what are these types of two forms of information transfer? The first one is verbal to non-verbal. And the second one is non-verbal to verbal. Yes. Now, what is verbal to non-verbal and non-verbal to verbal? We'll be seeing it. So, the first one, verbal to non-verbal. Now, what do we mean by verbal to non-verbal? A paragraph is given and you are expected to convert the information into tabular form, tree diagram, pie chart, web diagram or some other kind of non-verbal form. Just I told you in the beginning only, uh, a paragraph is given that is your verbal form of information and you are expect to convert, expected to convert that information either into a tabular form or a tree diagram, pie chart, web diagram or, or some other kind of non-verbal form. So, we will see how to transfer this verbal information into a non-verbal non information in our first example. Okay, read the following information and complete the following table. Okay, so this is information being given, a paragraph has been given and we are asked to complete the following table. So, what we will do, we will read the paragraph which is given and then we will complete the table. Fine. Chandrayaan 2, India's second mission to the moon will, for the first time, unravel secrets around the moon's south pole. Chandrayaan 2 is a three-part spacecraft, an orbiter, a lander and a rover. The lander is named after Vikram Sarabhai, the founder of the Indian space program. The rover is named Pragyan, meaning wisdom. Okay, we have one more. Chandrayaan 2 was launched on 22nd July atop ISRO's GSLV MK3 at 2.43 pm from the Satish Dhawan Space Center at Sri Harikota. Performing as expected, the rocket released Chandrayaan 2 in a highly elliptic orbit around the Earth and 17 around the Earth about 17 minutes later. So this is the paragraph which is being given to us about giving information about Chandrayaan 2. Okay. Now children, whenever you are doing any writing skill related to information transfer, you are going, the first important thing is that you are going to give a title to it. Yes. Whether you are transforming it from uh, verbal to non-verbal or non-verbal to verbal, title is of utmost importance. So when we start converting this verbal information paragraph which has been given to a table which is we will be seeing it first thing we will be writing the title so the title is very clear you can see it is very easy for us to get the title from the paragraph it is given it is talking about Chandrayaan 2 so the title of our information transfer will be Chandrayaan 2 and here we have the table okay so over here on the table in the left hand column we have name of the mission date of launch center of launch name of the rover founder of the Indian space program and what you can see underlined are the spaces uh, blanks which you need to be filled okay so what is the name of the mission yes what is the name of the mission the name of the mission is Chandrayaan 2 the date of launch it was 22nd July the center of launch it was Satish Dhawan space center Srihari Kota okay so you have to write the center of launch yes so the center of launch is Satish Dhawan space center if you just write Sri Hari Kota, you are not going to get marks. They have asked the center of launch. Okay. Name of the rover, it was the name was Pragyan. And founder of the Indian space program, Vikram Sarabhai. 
okay so see children over here you had to fill five blanks over here in the table your information transfer carries five marks whether it is verbal to non verbal or non verbal to verbal it will it is it will fetch you marks out of five so you are for sure if you do the information transfer from verbal to non verbal perfectly you will get full five marks yes if you write fill in all the details as it is expected from you okay so this is about the information transfer of verbal to non verbal fine then the second part one is verb non verbal to verbal so over here what is non verbal to verbal you will be given an information in the form of table points graphs etc yes it can be anything so it is a non verbal it not be in a paragraph form so it can be any way you have to transfer the information in a paragraph including all the points which are given yes so whatever points are given either in the table or the web or the chart or the point or the graph you have to include all those points in your paragraph and suitable title is to be given in both the forms whether it is non verbal to verbal or verbal to non verbal you have to give a suitable title to the information transfer fine so non verbal to verbal is you will be given an given an information in the form of a table points or graphs etc you have to transfer the information in a paragraph including all the points suitable title is to be given okay so we have a example for us here is some information about gulmohar trees given in a tabular form transfer the information into a paragraph so we have a table being given over here to us so this is the table it is given us in, giving us information about the gulmohar tree and we have to transfer this information into a paragraph children you have to read the question properly a paragraph means you have to write one single paragraph yes it is expected for information transfer whenever it is from non verbal to non verbal to verbal it has to be in one single paragraph you cannot write more than one or two paragraphs you will lose your marks for the format over there okay if you because if you write more than two one paragraph you are changing the format according to the format it has to be only one paragraph fine so gulmohar over here what we, the example which we have is a tabular uh, information about the gulmohar tree it is telling us about the size the height leaves flowers fruits roots okay so what is the size of a gulmohar tree its size is medium the height is modest how are the leaves the leaves are bright green compound leaves with feathery appearance how are the flowers flowers are bright orange red and yellow fruits it does not bear any fruit so none and roots leguminous nitrogen fixing properties yes so this is the information about the gulmohar tree and we have to transfer this into a paragraph so first important thing what we will write characteristics of the, see it is telling us about the gulmohar tree the characteristics of the gulmohar tree so our topic or the title of the information transfer is characteristics of gulmohar tree okay so we will be transforming it into the paragraph let's see what the paragraph is okay the gulmohar tree is of medium size it has modest height it has compound leaves that have a feathery appearance they are bright green in color it flowers are bright orange red and yellow these trees bear no fruits it has leguminous roots and have nitrogen fixing properties so we have we have included all these six points in our paragraph over here yes so the, the we have transferred the information given in the ta table into a single paragraph including all the points which was given we have not missed out any points so whatever points are given in the non verbal form and you have to convert it into the verbal form you have to include all the points even if you skip one point your marks will be deducted yes so when you are uh, you know during the exam when it is uh, you are going to uh, do this question it is a compulsory question but you will be having a choice between information transfer and sorry the non verbal form non verbal to verbal and verbal to non verbal you have to make a smart choice over here as to where you can get where, where you can get full marks yes so if you are it is very easy to transfer the information from the verbal to non verbal yes whereas when you are writing from 
नॉन वर्बल टू वर्बल देर आ देर इज रूम फॉर सम ग्रामेटिकल मिस्टेक और सम वे यू मिस आउट सम पॉइंट्स सो इट सिंस इट इज यू आर राइटिंग अ पैराग्राफ यू कैन नॉट गेट फुल फाइव मार्क्स ओवे बट इफ यू राइट इट एक्सेप्ट इन अ वेरी गुड मैनर यूजिंग गुड वर्ड्स देन यू कैन गेट गुड मार्क्स ओवर दे यस यू कैन गेट यू नो ऑलमोस्ट फोर फोर एंड हाफ ओवर यूर ऑल्सो यू कैन गेट इफ यू यूज गुड वो कैबलरी यस सो वेन यू आर फ्रेमिंग द सेंटेंसेज योर सेंटेंसेज हैज शुड बी एप्ट टू द टॉपिक वॉट यू आर राइटिंग ओके आई होप यू हैव अंडरस्टूड दिस द नॉन वर्बल एंड द वर्बल फॉर्म ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन ट्रांसफर यस सो इन्फॉर्मेशन ट्रांसफर इज दैट यू आर री राइटिंग अ इन्फॉर्मेशन फ्रॉम वन फॉर्म टू एन अदर द द टू फॉर्म्स ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन ट्रांसफर आर वर्बल टू नॉन वर्बल एंड नॉन वर्बल टू वर्बल इन वर्बल टू नॉन वर्बल अ पैराग्राफ इज बीन गिवन एंड यू एक्सपेक्टेड टू ट्रांसफर द इन्फॉर्मेशन आई द इन टू अ टेबल अ वेब डायग्राम अ ट्री डायग्राम अ चार्ट पाई चार्ट और अ फ्लो चार्ट एक्सेट्रा एनी अदर फॉर्म ऑफ नॉन वर्बल वेर एज इन नॉन वर्बल टू वर्बल the non verbal forms will be given and you are expected to write the transfer the information into a paragraph including all the points which are given in the non verbal form yes and most important one of the most important thing is you are going to give a title to the information transfer whichever you are opting for whether it be verbal to non verbal or non verbal to verbal so these are the important things which you have to keep in mind the title of for the tra- information transfer you will be there in the paragraph or in the points which has been given to you you uh, so you have to look out for it and think about it carefully and then write the info do the information transfer right i hope children you have understood this in uh, topic of information transfer it is very easy yes you don't have to by heart anything in over here it is just how you apply your english you know vocabulary into writing or framing the sentences fine so uh, you will uh, it would be better for you to copy down both these uh, non verbal to examples what we have done today in your notebooks and so that you can go back to it and see as to how it is to be done fine so uh, for then thank you sairam children have a good day